right. Um, I want to just start with your overall thoughts on on the win. You guys break out of the slide. Uh, it's got to feel pretty good, right? Yeah, it was a really important win for the team. Um, we we really needed it. We we're in a in a bad place. We felt like we were trending in the right direction. We were doing the right things. We just weren't getting the results. So uh, it was really good to to get the three points because then it, you know it, it justifies our performances. And so we just have to keep working like this and keep getting better in certain phases. And then you know we got to keep keep uh, keep going to get more wins. And can you take me through the goal you scored? It was a bit of a wacky play, and it was from yeah. from distance. It was a bit of a bomb. So uh, can you take me through it? Yeah, I, mean, I thought it was goal of the season, but nah. nah. <laughs> I mean, it took a it took a good it took a it took a good deflection, but you just got to put it in there, and you never know what happens. It, me, me and Rito were talking the the week of the game, and he was telling me to shoot more when I get those opportunities top of eighteen. And then look, you know, you get a you get a shot, it takes a deflection, it goes in, but so it's important, you know, it goes in. And no one really cares how it goes in. Just got ball, just got to go in the net. A couple. It was brutal conditions as well. I mean, really, it seemed like it was really tough out there. The field and the and the heat and everything. How did you guys adapt to that, and how did it kind of affect you? Yeah, it was it was really tough. I'm not gonna lie. It was very very difficult. It was like 108 degrees to start tick, uh, the start of a kickoff. You know, it was kind of like when you when you open an oven and that heat just kind of hits you. It was like that, but constantly out on the field. So, I mean, but we don't really have a choice. We have to adapt to it. You know, uh, we can't make excuses. They're playing in it as well. Of course, they're more used to it than we are. You know, because we train in weather like this, which is which is really nice. Um, so we just we had to adapt to it, and we had to play in the circumstances that we were dealt with, and, and luckily we were able to still get three points out of it. Yeah, and, and on that note, though, you're, you come off you know a tough loss versus Tulsa, and a lot of those games have you know been in those last ten minutes, and in heat like that, fatigue can really start to set in, and you were able to you know the team's able to persevere and get through those moments. Yeah. How big is that for the confidence and the momentum going forward? Yeah, for, I mean for me that's just mentality. You know we were we were switching off the last moments of games, and uh, for me that that just that's not a winning mentality. You know we we were able to go into Vegas, and even when we were up a goal to still get a second, and then even in moments when they were pressuring us, especially in the beginning. Of the first half we still we still kept our composure we kept our cool we defended really well every single guy that was out there on the field so uh it was it was really really important and, and we didn't switch off that was the most important thing you know a lot of times this season we switched off in little moments and then we got scored on so that was really really difficult for us and that's something that Omid's can been kind of pushing every single day so I mean that was the most important thing we didn't switch off and we kept that winning mentality throughout the game and Vegas at times seemed like they were knocking on the door getting really close I mean Joe made a couple of really good saves and how, so that second goal, you know, late in the game, how big is that going into those last yeah, moments? Yeah, it was huge. I mean, I, I told Kyle when he came in, I said, listen, if you get that second goal, we're going to win this game. And he did exactly that. So, you know, so, I mean, every single person that came onto the field, Kembo, Kyle, Antoine, all the guys that came in, they, they gave us life, they gave us energy, and that was really, really important. Um, and, yeah, like you said, you know, they were pressuring us a lot. And then when we were able to get that second goal, it helped us, you know, kind of breathe a little bit because we had that little bit of cushion. But I think it was still important that we didn't even let them get a get a goal when we were up 2-0 to keep that clean sheet. You now it's important for the defenders. It's important for Joe as well, you know, because uh, he played a really good game. So it, it's nice that he can have a clean sheet as well. Yeah, and you mentioned it, you're building, you know, coming off a, a tough loss on the road, you're getting a really big win here. Final game of the road stretch comes against another very good team in the West, another tough environment. Yeah. What do you take from this game to bring into next week? Uh, we just have to keep the same momentum, keep doing what we're doing right. You know, we, we watch film, we, we, uh, we critique a couple of things that, you know, we can improve on. So we have to keep building on, on what we're doing well and fixing the things that we're still doing wrong. And then, you know, San Antonio is a, a very good team. It's a really, really difficult place to play. And I played there a couple of times. You know, they get a lot of fans. They make it really, really hard for you the way they press. So we just have to keep, keep doing what we're doing and then, you know, be ready to battle. You know, it's going to be a very, very difficult game. But, I mean, every single guy that's going to be on there on the field is going to give 100%.